Motif is the fastest way for developers to publish content. Let's see how. Front-end frameworks like Next.js and Remix, combined with serverless platforms like Vercel and Netlify, are the engines powering today's best websites, in large part due to their exceptional performance metrics, rich feature set, and incredible DX. This setup is used increasingly for building content such as rich blogs and documentation sites, thanks to technologies like MDX, Markdoc, and the React component ecosystem. We love this. However, when it comes to actually authoring and publishing new content, the experience leaves much to be desired. Let's see how publishing even a simple blog with Markdown files is complicated. First, I need to have an up-to-date Node.js environment running on my local machine. And yes, if you're new to this, you need to go through hoops to get there. Next, I have to set up a fresh project, here using Next.js. For my posts, I want to use MDX as it allows me to include React components inside of my Markdown content. I need to install the dependencies and include the MDX build pipeline in my next configuration. I also want to use Tailwind CSS for my styles, so I need to understand how this works. Now that all the dependencies have been installed and configured, I have to set up the page structure. I'll use a folder named Post for my content. I need to tell Next where to find the posts and how to extract the page metadata such as the title and the date. This is done in get static paths and get static props. Okay, now that the code is ready, it's time to write actual content. I'll create my first post in MDX, give it a title and a date, write a few lines of text and add an image. Wait, how do I add an image? Is there some place where I can drag and drop it? Of course not. This is a bare bones coding environment. Okay, the public folder works. I also want to make sure that my images are served fast, so I'll want to use Next.js's image optimization feature, but in order to get there, I need to understand how Markdown component mapping works in MDX. The list goes on. I could continue talking about setting up SEO, building a blog index and a sitemap, supporting syntax highlighting and math equations and more, but you get the point. Oh, and to actually host the blog on my custom domain, I need to sign up with a hosting provider and set up an integration that will trigger on new git pushes to the main branch. Each time I update my blog, I need to commit my code, push it, and wait for the host to launch the build process before my pages become available publicly. The end result is great. But to get there, there was a lot to learn and to configure, and probably there will be a lot to relearn as frameworks and libraries evolve over time. And while this process is suited for some situations, in others it feels like a sledgehammer to crack a nut. Can we make the above process less painful? Well, how about we get rid of it altogether and get you straight into creative mode? Let's see how the process looks in Motif. I simply sign in to Motif.land, create a new project, and start writing my MDX. When ready, I hit publish. That's it, I'm live. What happened here? First, Motif runs a super fast build and bundle process in the browser with zero configuration. Yes, thanks to recent browser support for ES modules, Node and NPM are no longer required. That gets us rid of the Node setup part. Next, we set you up with the MDX and Markdoc compilation pipelines, Tailwind configuration, page generation, metadata extraction, image optimization, and SEO, so you don't have to. It just works right away. Finally, we take care of the hosting and ship your content as an optimized Next.js application hosted on Vercel's Edge CDN. No git, no build, and publish step. We call it ship as you type. Let's go through this in more detail. Motif features a split screen mode, and as I type on the left, I immediately see the rendered result on the right. It's way faster than hot module reload. If I want to use a package from the web, I can do so with a single import statement. It's blazing fast. By default, it's going to resolve on Skypack, but I can also provide full URLs. And I can import content from other places in my project, just like I would do locally. Motif can handle MDX, Markdoc, JavaScript, TypeScript, JSX, JSON, and even plain text imports. Motif also ships with Tailwind 3, Prism, Syntax Highlighting, and KTEX Equations, and will soon support Remark, Rehype, and RecMap plugins. The editor is based on Monaco, which is the same editor that powers VS Code. It has syntax highlighting, prettier formatting, linting, and auto-completions. And yes, we added drag and drop. Simply drop one or more images or even files, and we host it for you so you don't have to think about it. Templates are located in the Templates folder, and it's easy to apply them to individual pages or to sets of pages. Furthermore, all the page's metadata are exposed, so it's straightforward to do things like auto-generating a blog index or a sidebar for your doc's site. 
publishing to a custom domain is instantaneous. Behind the scenes, we build your site as a Next.js application, leveraging technologies like incremental static regeneration and Next image optimization for optimal page performance. We also host it on Vercel's Edge network, so you don't need to worry about setting up hosting and deployment pipelines. And if you want to host the content yourself or edit it with your favorite editor, you can do this by setting up file sync with a local folder on disk. All content created on Motif is in plain text, and there's no vendor lock-in. And here's something exciting. Motif provides a frictionless way to share content and components as ES modules behind a URL. Let's say you want to create a component library to reuse across your projects. You can simply select the components you want to be part of your library, set a semantic version, and hit publish. You now have an optimized production-ready library that can be used in any project that understands ES modules. This replaces the tedious process of publishing to NPM, which again feels like a sledgehammer in many day-to-day -day situations. Finally, Motif is real-time collaborative, so it's easy to bring other people on board and work together, for instance, on writing technical docs. It's so simple to jump on board that even people with no coding experience feel welcome to contribute. To sum up, Motif provides the glue between best-in-class front-end tooling and a streamlined authoring experience. We aim to remove all the barriers to entry that currently exist so that you can go from thought to live in the blink of an eye. We're just getting started and you can find more about Motif on motif.land.